Okay. 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 Okay.
What's up, gamers? <laughs> We're playing some more Resident Evil Zero today. Hey, Lady G, how's it going? What's up? It's new today. Let's see, we got to the church. We, uh, we defeated a giant bat. Because, as I said, this is old school Resident Evil's theory on doing things. Big spiders, big snakes, big bats, big lizards. Just take ugly rodent, reptile, whatever. Make it big. Make it big. Make it big. Not too big, but pretty big. <laughs> You're entering an insane world. Okay. Yeah, we made some progress last night, just a little bit. Um, okay. Okay. Hmm, so they want me to shuffle some of the... We'll do that later. We'll shuffle around the gear here in a minute. Yeah, I don't know, maybe... We might be able to finish this tonight. We might, uh... Might to do another thing like we did today. Or yesterday where I'll, uh... Take a little dinner break. And then we'll come back. Come back in the evening and put in a couple hours. You stay here. Okay. Well, not like he can go up anyway. Going up to the roof of the church. This is not good. They don't put ladders on churches. Not a thing. Been to a lot of churches. I'll tell you, I know a thing or two. Favorite Bible verse? <laughs> I don't have any. They're all so great. They're so great. No, I can't even think of one. There's just so many good ones. Who could choose? Who could choose? Not me. I'll tell you that. Uh, <laughs> Raging Girl. Welcome to the stream. How's it going? A scenic view of the lake can be seen from the cliff. Okay, but what about the red herb there? I don't think I can. I don't have enough space. Do I even have... Do I even have a green herb? I don't think I do. The door is now unlocked. Oh, okay. Oh, well... Oh, the switch right there. Duh. I'm like, what is that? The circuit breaker appears to be supplying power to the elevator. Lift the handle.
<laughs> Doing good? Good, good. Good to hear. I think we only have two more areas to uh, play through. And since we did like a whopping three or four areas yesterday, <laughs> like holy crap. Okay, the Maltovs are here. Uh, the Magnum rounds, I know I'm gonna wanna bring those over. There, there should be a save room. Let's regroup. Okay. Should be a save room. Cause I gotta, I gotta bring all these items down. My knee. It's it's the same with every game. Uh, you just go to like a haunted mansion or whatever, and then there's like other buildings, and then there's always a secret lab underneath, and there's always sewers, and it's like, oh come on. Resident Evil never changes, for better or worse. They're like, ah, what if we what if we made a house in uh. Louisiana. Oh, but there's a secret lab under it. No one will see that coming. We've done it the past seven times and, and nobody's ever seen it coming. Marcus's Diary 2. This page has been torn out. Trouble is unlikely, but I closed my babies up in a special capsule. That's weird. But it won't be safe if I hold on to it myself. I'll hide it in that place. To hide a leaf, put it in a forest. Okay, that's weird. Don't don't ever say that. Um, to open the capsule, the special stripping agent is necessary. No way Spencer's lackeys could figure out how to make it. Stripping. Abs is breathtaking. Who is this new? viewer that has entered my stream <laughs> abs is breathtaking whoa okay i'm gonna dump items here then let's do this this ah. What's going on, dude? I'll go check over there. Yeah. You stay right there. You know what I'll do? I'll I'll put the hook thing over here because that's probably what the hook is. Yeah, I don't want to see that. Not that. I need the Magnum, the grenade launcher, Magnum rounds, the grenade launcher, and the grenades. I need four slots. Kind of last minute, but much needed. Yeah, yeah, dude. That's that's exciting, dude. I think breathtaking suits you and your uh, your vibe. I'm gonna send her back up the elevator. Oh my god! Yeah, that's crazy. No, there's gotta be somebody, somebody local. I don't know how much the Best Buy Geek Squad is. Rent a geek. Oh yeah, dude, I was checking out. You're playing some Doom Eternal. I was like, oh man, that's running good. <laughs> Mr. Mr. Game Pass over here. <laughs> Mr. Game Pass, Mr. Nintendo Online. <laughs> you got PlayStation Plus as well, right? 
Cause I, I think you're, I think you're banking on everything right now, aren't you? I might have to make another trip. Ah, I forgot about the Molotovs too. Yeah, I'm gonna have to make two trips. Yikes, yikes, yikes. Yeah, that's that's really overpriced. Hmm. Looking forward to that game so much. Uh, 14 days. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, 14 days of which one? Uh, was uh, uh game pass? Out of all those, I I would do game pass. Like, I I think there's too much value in that, and it's way less expensive than any of the alternatives. Mm -hmm. I've been good, man. Uh, we've been doing the whole Spooktober thing. Uh, we got a bunch of spooky games we're going to be playing right here. Did I do? No. Oh, no, it's Shocktober. Sorry, I can't even... I can't even remember my own branding. Ah, what an amateur. Yeah, so there's a list of games we'll be playing, and of course we'll be uh, taking clips. Anybody that makes clips uh, in all these spooky games that we're playing here, uh, you make a clip, it might end up in a compilation that I'll try to put together at the end of the month as sort of a mashup of all the all the memories we've got here, and it'll be a It'll be a good promo for next year as well, you know? Okay, you got one year of Nintendo Online. Cool, cool. Yeah, that's good because you, you also get access to the NES and the SNES games, right? I think, I think we're friends on Switch. I think so. Let me know if we're not, because I mean, I can, I can definitely add you. Cause it's, it, oh, and you know what we'd have to do? We'd have to meet up on Animal Crossing so that, uh, so we can mail each other stuff, you know? Definitely. Definitely a thing. We need to do that. Okay, let me go get the rest of the gear. Annie? Or Angie? Was it Angie? Ask Angie? Or something like that? I don't know. Oh, you got Super Mario 35? Have you, have you played it yet? I noticed from watching, uh, or a tour, uh, if you check out him, uh, I'll shout out his channel. He's probably, in my opinion, I think he's one of the best Mario streamers out there. Um, he does a lot of Mario Maker, and he does those super expert levels, like, no problem. So he was playing Mario 35, and once he got the Fire Flower, he just kept shooting that. He just kept shooting fireballs. And he, he just he just sit there and spam that and kill every enemy so that he could send those enemies into other players' worlds. And so once he did that, once he got the Fire Flower, he was OP. And I watched him I watched him for several hours and he won every match. First place. Every time. I, which I'm not surprised, because he's really freaking good, but at the same time, I was like, Jesus, if that's the strat, you know? And it seems like if you kick, if you kick a turtle into other enemies, that does a, a multiplier. So that's actually worth the most. Whereas fire flowers only, those kills only get you one second added to your time. Uh, the turtle, it, it like racks up. It adds a point with each enemy. 
it's like more and more and more and more yeah he's really cool dude he usually comes on i guess he's american i think he comes on the american nighttime but yeah if you're ever looking for just like some chill mario gameplay he's really good just unbelievably yeah yeah the old uh, oh it's and here's here's a cool distinction i think it's the what is it they call it the special you, you notice how there's like two versions of the same game the special one like gives you i think it either gives you all the gear or like it gives you some stuff to start it kind of like makes the game a little easier it's re that's actually a really good feature because the original zelda zelda one and two were like stupid hard Especially back in the day, probably not as much now, but they're still pretty difficult games. So I think it gives you a leg up to get started. I think they did that with Metroid. I think they did it with most of the Zelda games. They they give you that special edition. It's quite nice. Uh, you played Twilight Princess and Breath of the Wild. Dude, Twilight Princess might be one of my favorites. Like behind ocarina of time i think it's probably my second favorite yeah yeah it's really good from an accessibility perspective and and just maybe just making the game more enjoyable for you know casual players that are going to come in and play that because like i am by no means i'm not that hardcore that's those games are hard <laughs> i'm not gonna it i i will definitely take any uh Any assists they're willing to give me, as far as that goes. I don't know if he's dead. This is a safe room, but... And lead more items. Okay, I gotta... Gotta pick up some. That, that's herbs. Okay, let me get this. Get the ink ribbon. Yeah, if Skyward Sword really is getting a remaster though, I'm I'm gonna wait on that. I'll grab the remaster. Cause you know what? Everybody hates Skyward Sword, but it's be I think it's because of the motion controls. That was one of the games that's motion control only. You don't own a capture card, a webcam, or a mic. Okay, okay. Um, still need to play Skyward Sword, Ocarina, Majora's Mask, and Wind Waker. Yeah. Yeah, and Link to the Past on the SNES. That's that's a must must play. Yeah, it's it's kind of dumb. Like I get it if you don't like motion controls, like. That's fine, but... Uh... Like, that doesn't make, like, the game itself, you know, in terms of gameplay, story, visuals, stuff like that. Like, it looks like a perfectly fine Zelda game. And, and you know, Twilight Princess got the same hate, you know, because people didn't want to play with the motion controls. So the GameCube version kind of ends up being the superior version but then they did the remaster on the wii u which allowed you to use controller if you wanted so that was nice uh animal crossing and persona 5 yeah persona 5 is so much it i feel like if you were streaming that you'd probably never get through <laughs> it's just it just seems like a lot of game a lot of game all right what does billy have because Oh, he's just Mr. Ammo over here. Let me see what I need here. Oh, hmm. Hmm. 
Okay. So I'm gonna I'm gonna swap out some uh some stuff here. Yeah, yeah, for some for some that's listen, that's the reason I'm not playing it. I can't. I don't have time for that anywhere in my life. Just not at all. Sorry! <laughs> I, I really don't. Oh, you saw a Shawshank. Oh, dude, that's, yeah, that's a must-see. You need to give him... Let me get this right. over here. Even Breath of the Wild, 200 hours, that's the most I put in a video game. That's, that's not even Kingdom Hearts related. Yeah, that's true. That's true. That's a lot, man. It really is. Come on. Okay. I'll check it out. Roger. Yeah, that's crazy. Gabs! What's up, Gabs? How's it going? Gibbs. I mean, we got heals. We got pistol ammo. Uh, we'll save here in a sec. Save. It's too hot in Brazil. I hate it here. Send help. <laughs> We need, we need some ice. Send Gab some ice. Chill. 15 saves. Hmm. All right, let's send Billy up. Yeah, it's, uh, 79 Fahrenheit today. Pretty hot. Okay, it says to use the Maltovs on the leeches, so I'm gonna try that. Ooh, lab manager's diary. 35C here. Uh, take a little of your heat in exchange for the freezing basement. Oh, man. Today, under Director Marcus's orders, I changed the platform entry code. Later, I asked him what the source of the entry code was. He told me it was based on something significant in his children's growth. But the director's a loner, he isn't married, and he sure doesn't have any children. What did he mean? Look at it so we get it. Oh, fuck. Did we get it? Oh, damn. I oh, damn. And there's some bottles. Yeah, we're gonna make some more Molotovs. Dee 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 dee. 
Okay, and then there's a save room up here. If I didn't give Billy... Well, there should be some ink. There's always ink. Next to... Uh... Can I drop that? in here collection of leech samples press the button one of the capsules is glowing gross it's it's ugh. it's leaking brown stuff no no thanks no thanks. Okay, so what's next? Um, we're in B1. Okay. It, it says I'm gonna find more Maltov materials, so I guess I will take this with us. Cool, cool. Okay. Did. What does the button do? Oh. I hope he doesn't go after Rebecca. Carry it. Okay, I need to drop something real quick so I can... Yes, I'll save. I mean, ugh. we'll make two saves. Machine room.
Oh, that's right, because I got the ink. You got ink, bro. Mardcore. Drop the ink. Are you gonna get inked, bro? Yeah, I got inked. It's locked. Even though there's glass windows everywhere. You can't get in this room. No, I don't like this. Okay, uh... I guess we'll come back later. Spooky, spooky sounds, uh, leech capsule. Mm. Okay. Here. That did not go the way I wanted it to go. Oh, what's up, loser? You suck. Okay. Now the other one's gonna bite me. Cause I can't figure out the way the camera, fucking camera. All right, what's on the paper? Uh, leech growth records, February third, nineteen seventy-eight. Administered tea into four, four leeches. It's in red. Don't forget it. Four, four leeches. Four. Uh, their will to survive leads them first to parasitism and predation. Then they breed and multiply. Such a single-minded biology makes them attractive candidates for bioweapons research. Afterwards, no major changes observed. February 10th, 1978. Seven days since the administration of T. Rapid growth to double former size. Signs of transformation emerging. Spawning successful. They double their numbers. So that's four times two. That's eight. Eight. In one hour. But their ravenous appetites lead them to cannibalism. Hastened to increased food supply. But lost two. Uh, March 7th, 1978. Provided them with live feed but lost half when the hive food fought, live food fought back. However, the leeches are learning from experience and are beginning to exhibit group attack behavior. They are also ceasing cannibalism. Their evolution is exceeding expectations. April uh, 22nd, 1978. The leeches no longer exhibit individual behavior. Even when not feeding, they move as a collective. They consume everything I offer with remarkable efficiency. April 30, 30end, 30end, 1978. An employee has stumbled onto my experiments. Can a human be a food source? How will the leeches respond? June 3rd. A day worthy of commemoration. Today they began to mimic me. 
Surely they recognize their father. Wonderful children, no one will take you away. Okay, so. All right, let's, uh, where's my puzzle? Puzzle notebook here. <clears throat> and Mr. T into four leeches. Boom. Four. Uh, they double their numbers. Eight. Uh, hastened to increase food supply, but lost two. So that brings us down to six. Provide them with live feed, and then lost half, which brings us down to three. So I think the code is four, eight, six, three. Oh, yeah. Oh, check this out. Got this today. Yep. Yep. Get get my Avengers stuff, gamers. Yep. So apparently there's a code on every pack. So I bought a six pack. So I got six codes. Uh, it says in-game content for Marvel's Avengers. And see, I got the box. It's got Cap. It's got Iron Man and Miss Marvel. That, that factored in a lot, actually. I'm a little embarrassed. That factored in more than it should have. Now back to our game. Okay, there's a poison in there. Not good. Puzzle. And a chemical. Okay. Yeah, there was a green container in one of the rooms, and this one's got a red container. Interesting. Gross. Uh. Mm, double doors. Okay. Okay. Uh. This is when I'm really missing having a third monitor. Missing it. Let's send her, send her the Maltovs so she can kill the leech monster. She's <laughs> bored out of her mind. Okay. Okay, she has enough, enough space. Uh. So we'll send her, it says we need to send her the leech. Oh my gosh! Woo! Oh, there's another one, hang on. I think there's another one. I hear him. Uh, 
That, that was a good one. That was a good scare. I was not expecting that. Ah. Uh, send her the leeches. Hey, Rebecca, I got you something. It's a jar of leeches. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Oh, don't forget, it's covered in, in brown slime. Mm -hmm. You boys. Boys are dead. Okay. Oh, there's a green uh, container there. Ooh, we got a note. Nice little torture room in here. Investigators report. Dr. Marcus, co-founder with President Spencer of the Umbrella Corporation, disappeared 20 years ago. The results of his research have been kept under wraps the entire time. The reason became clear here at the training facility run by Dr. Marcus. Well, not here exactly, but underground. When we ventured below, we understood... There we found the evidence of Dr. Marcus's research into the T-virus prototype called Progenitor. Uh, the evidence of years of hideous experimentation that used company employees as guinea pigs. We cannot know how many were forced to become subjects, but based on the evidence, no less than 20 individuals were involved. Some of them were taken deliberately to keep the information, the corporation's secret safe. Uh, where the doctor is now, I don't know, but considering the recent rapid growth of Umbrella Corporation, I can't help but think that this research is continuing. Yes, his experiment lives and continues to grow in the dark. Those things, the fruit of his research, they fill this facility. The rest of the notebook pages are missing. Little, little healer. I could take that. All right, what is this? The store is decorated with the bust of Marcus. There's a space in the base for some kind of object, which we don't have. I'm going to go ahead and save. Mm -hmm. Good, looking good. Okay. Carpet. Carpet. Oh, Resident Evil. What's up, Pinky? How's it going, dude? Resident Evil. Yeah, we're playing uh, Resident Evil Zero. This is part of our uh, entire month games. Shocktober. We'll be playing nothing but horror game I'm gonna drop 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 the ink have this ready mm. all right we gotta land it on this bad boy Oh yeah, get some. Ow. Ow. 
Fuck you, dude. No! Oh no! Fuck. Dude, you can't do shit! Really? Dude's gonna kill me. Fucking die! Yeah, she literally almost died. Wow. Well, I'm gonna go back in and get some healing. Healing supplies. I killed one of those so easily just a few minutes ago as Billy. But of course... Wait, where'd that zombie go? Nah, there was a zombie right here, bro. I didn't forget about it. <laughs> Don't die, Aaron. <laughs> I didn't mean to pick up the fucking... I think I'm gonna take that one. Okay. Probably equip a uh, pistol. So we're not gonna run into any. Uh... any of those losers. Hmm. depicts a woman embracing a demon. Oh, that's that's not good. Oh, there it is. And then there's another red herb. That's ridiculous. Forget what kind of herb was that upstairs? Um, I might just send one up to uh, Billy. Did he pick it up? Maybe he picked it up. Yeah, he's got the green herb. I'm gonna send that down so we can uh, do that. Huh, hard pass. I don't want to make out with the leech man. No thanks. gotta go in through that combination
Go ahead and grab this so we can mix mix it up. Okay. Cool, cool. Uh I don't know if we need the Molotovs right now. Because Yeah, I don't know. Couldn't say anything there about needing that, so I'll drop that for now. So we have extra space. Spencer? Oh, that's Marcus. Space in the base for some kind of object. Cool, cool. Device for entering. Combinations missing part and can't be used. Okay. Um, bop, 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 bop. The red. Oh no, I didn't get anything from the green canister. I should have done that. Uh oh. Yeah, I didn't get the green from earlier. If you don't have it, return to the training facility and go to the infirmary near the room with the life size chessboard. Oh, fuck. Uh, chest, chest board. Yeah, that room. Okay. I should have thought of that. This is gonna suck. more coffee maybe No monkeys. Okay. 
Okay, then we go this way. Mm hmm. I don't remember if there was a, a zombie or. I hope there's no leech. Leech man. Okay, so it was in here, and then it's like the first door on the right, something like that. Let's see. Yeah, first door on the right. Good Lord. I can't even. I know I'll take even more damage if I try to fight him. Fuck, squirrel idiot. Caution. Okay, where is this fucking? It said it was in the chest room. Was it? Dude, if you. You fucking people are lying to me. I feel like I'm being lied to right now. Oh, near the room. Oh, thanks. Yeah, that's great. No! No! Oh my God. Yep. No need to see a doctor. Your heart is all good. Yeah, this is the room. See? I should have thought to have, uh... A stripping agent. Yeah, this is bad. He's bad. Rebecca's in danger. Okay, so. Run down the hallway. Take the corner. My hope is that I can juke him at the corner and not take so much damage. I'm gonna die. Look at this shit! <sighs> I just healed! Die, you motherfuckers. Fucking monkeys, man. And I love how the guide says, yeah, if you didn't get the green stuff yet, you didn't get the green chemical, you should have gotten it earlier, but it didn't mention it earlier. That's, that's a serious mishap in the guide. If you had to throw that in parentheses saying, oh, if you didn't get it earlier, it's in this room that you could have got when there weren't any fucking monkeys. No crying over the monkeys. They're, nope. Can't cry if they die. Nope. They're bad, bad monkeys. And I would kill them if it wasn't even more troublesome. Ridiculous. Use two healing things.
Wait, did I get that? I brought the red herb down that was up here. Didn't I? I'm gonna check the map. I think I did? Just got cornered by those two monkeys. Oh yeah, it's just the knife up there. Okay. I don't care about the plates. She's in danger. Now she's fine. Mm -mm. I don't know who's going to need those Molotovs next. Okay, so we're sending this up to Billy because he's at the blue door. I'm cheating. What do you mean I'm cheating? I'm not cheating. Yeah, this game... Oh no, that's I didn't I thought that door was blue, but yeah, this is the green door. Shit. I need to send that back down. Whoopee. Some intense item transferring. Oh you guys love item management inventory. Yeah. That's what we're really here for. How long is this game? Well, counting uh, all the inventory crap you gotta do. Jeez. We still have two more areas to go through. It's, it's, I think it's pretty lengthy, honestly. I'm not, I'm not sure exactly what the hour count is, how many hours. Resident Evil Zero meant to be um i'm doing zero then one then we'll do the remakes of two and three and then i think Brittany said she'll uh do some co-op we'll continue our resident evil 6 that we were doing earlier this year okay so now we can get in i've never played resident evil 4 and they're probably re I think they're remaking that one. Ooh, who's this? Large painting hangs on the wall. The title reads, Woman in Love with a Dead Man. Oh boy. Yeah. I, I can see the appeal. Uh, input regulator oil. Something else here. Uh-oh. 
something written on the back of the photograph. To James, to commemorate your graduation, 1939. Wait, if that's the long-haired dude, that guy's got to be super old. He's not aging. That guy must be Marcus's son. Or grandson. Okay, well, you're you're wrong. Uh, do all of them this next week? I don't know. We'll we'll see how I feel after this one. I might need a we might need to like work in a different game just to freshen it up. But I will be playing them in order, so we will be able to sort of follow along uh, chronologically. Mysterious objects are floating in the water. Yeah, it's not good. Just hoping I don't burn out on this. What is this? Oh, it's for the cable car. Gotcha. Yeah. Resident Evil... The original Resident Evil is not quite as bad as this one. This one's just annoying because there's no item boxes. Get up. I dare you. Ah! Oh, the Last Supper. Oh, that's so cool. Four separate sheets. Doesn't seem to be anything special about it. Yeah, like everything else is like a woman having orgy with a horse. And and then there's like woman who's kind of attracted to dead guys. And then there's like um The Last Supper. Little out of place, guys. L little out of place with all your demonic imagery. The leech charm. Get out of here. You think leeches are going to bust out of this aquarium here? Oh, okay. Maybe not. Uh, uh, that jump scare would get me. Even anticipating it. I'd be like, ah! <laughs> Yeah, what what was this? No? No, it was this one. Yeah, woman totally making out with the demon. He looks kind of shy, too. He's got his legs all bundled up like this. He's like, ooh, I don't know. <laughs> He's like, ooh, that was my first kiss. <laughs> He's, a, He's a shy little demon. Uh, okay. So, what do we want to do? Send the green leech charm. <clears throat> Use the to open the green door. <laughs> Might be his first kiss. I don't think demons have a lot of time to make it. Yeah, I know. Like, you know, surprisingly. Don't have a lot of time for that, do they? Mm -mm. Yikes. I want to know where that guy went. I actually don't want to know, but I'm curious. It doesn't say what to do with the regulator coil. So 
I don't know if I need to send that up as well. whatever all right stay here Rebecca be a good girl all right Billy what do we got check out his inventory okay got no shotgun rounds Torture room. You know, it's it's really nice that they were so forward thinking that they put a drain there. Because, yeah, you really are going to get a lot of blood in, in a nice torture room, you know? And you, you don't want to have to add in a drain afterwards. You, you're going to have to tear up the whole room just to add a drain on the floor. It's, it's just a pain. It's a headache. Ugh. Just another... Another thing, you know, and then you, and then you gotta have the room in renovation, then you won't be able to use it for torturing for a while, so you gotta take a few weeks off, and that's just not gonna work so well. Huh. Motherfucker. I even tried to shoot him. You all saw that, gamers. What's this? Sterilizing agent. Handgun ammo. Send that down to... Mm, handgun bullet, uh, sterilizing agent on the control deck in front of the gas chamber. Maybe fall off the gas and open the door. Inside the open chamber is the breeding room key, as well as a zombie. Huh. Boy. We want to go back to which room was that? Yeah, that room. Okay. Two rooms over. Mm. I'm gonna get some coffee here in a sec. Let's uh let's Clear this room here. He's gonna get up, isn't he? Stupid fucker. It appears to be a device for pumping gas into the room next door. The device is empty. that in oh yeah no nope, I don't like that no thank you Did I not grab the item? 
me check the map. That's bullshit. I don't think I did. I didn't want to waste ammo. Really? What is this? Oh, it's like a monster. Ooh. Ooh, that's kind of gross. Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't like that. Chris Lee, hi. What you doing? What is it? What is it? What you doing? You want something? You want to go outside? Do you want something? You want something? Mm. Eating. Some key to which door was that? Mm. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, shit. Uh, I think there's going to be hunters. What are you doing? Is that the wrong door? Yes, it is. Okay. Why? Why are they call it? Why are they call it the breathing room. Never mind. Two rounds. Fuck. That's not gonna be enough. I'm gonna have her send up the Molotov and the pistol. I'm not playing around with hunters. Nope. And I bet I bet the camera is going to be just in the position to screw me. That's that's typically how they like to do it. For me? You. Thanks. I'm gonna send up the pistol anyway, just in case.
I'm gonna save because if this goes wrong, we we'll lose like 30 minutes of like shuffling items around and unlocking rooms and just simple little things that are gonna really suck. Redo. All right, I'm gonna grab some coffee too uh, before we uh, start up this next. That is the case. Okay. Mm. And I'll have us right outside the hunter room. Because there's going to be two of them, I think. I'm never that lucky. They say a few shotgun blasts. I'm like, mm, two's not going to be enough. Because either one, w the spread won't hit one of them. You know, it's, it's always something. So stupid. Or like one of them will be around the corner or something like that. It'll be something stupid. Something stupid like that. Or the camera will be looking at me instead of them, and I won't be able to tell where they're at, so I'll just have to, like, blind fire. And that's going to be a waste. And then if they get too close, then I won't be able to throw the Molotovs because they'll keep clawing at me. So, there's that, too. Like, there's just so many ways that I envision this uh, going wrong. All right, I'll be right back in just a few minutes. I'm just going to get some coffee. Quack, quack. What are you guys doing? Are you guys for real? Quack, quack, quack. You guys have a lot to talk about? Yeah, me too. Whoa! Alright, I'll, I'll catch you guys later.
Quack, quack. What are you guys doing? Are you guys for real? Quack, quack, quack. You guys have a lot to talk about? Yeah, me too. Whoa! Alright, I'll, I'll catch you guys later. All right, gamers. Back to it. Uh, let's see. 
it. We're about to go into the room with the hunters. Let's see here. I'll walk through. Walk through. Okay, hey, use the breeding room key. Boy, here we go, here we go, here we go. Please don't give me the camera, don't give me the camera. Fucking Pokemon game over here. Fucker. I fucking die, dude. We bring the dial down to Rebecca where I enter the code that I figured out. So BOW report. Research to date has shown that when the progenitor virus is administered to living organisms, violent cellular changes cause a breakdown in the system. Furthermore, no satisfactory method has been found to control the organisms for use as weapons. Clearly, greater coordination at the cellular level is essential to enable further growth. I conducted a number of experiments in an effort to find a breakthrough. This is my report. Insecta. Perhaps because these ancient animals have been genetically stable for millennia when administered with the progenitor virus, they exhibited only explosive high energy growth and increased aggressiveness. This is extremely difficult to envision using them as BOW. Amphibia. Injecting a frog with the virus resulted in an increase of leaping power and abnormal tongue growth. However, no change in malleability was observed. Furthermore, abnormal appetite resulted in the test subject randomly attacking all moving objects. Usefulness for BOW is limited. Mammalia, progenitor virus was merged with monkey cellular DNA, resulted in increased fertility, resulting young exhibited improved aggressiveness and some increased mental capacity as a side effect. Visual power is lost. This was offset by an improvement in hearing ability. However, they were unsatisfactory as weapons. It does seem that no progress can be made without making humans the base organism. Yikes. Yikes. I don't like that. So I gotta send the dial down.
item is too large. Doesn't look like you can put it in. Hang on, phone call. Now this is more like it. Billy here. Billy, I found an aerial cable car. We can get out of this place. Go, wait there, I'm coming. Roger, the sooner we get out of here, the better. Out.
Okay, I'm back. Just that quick phone call. Okay, so we need... We'll get the ink here. through here.
Okay. Grab all our stuff from the library. Anything we think we need. It's the next area. Check it out. Roger.
you grab my shotgun. I don't, I don't feel comfortable without that. in there we go here and save before we uh, attempt anything.
I'll go alone. Okay. This way. Okay. Okay, let me check this walkthrough for a second. Monkeys, dude.
freaking leeches unplugged it. In the train. Not that difficult. <laughs> Shouldn't be. He's gonna get up, 100%.
All right, I'm gonna take a short break and uh, feed the dog, and then we'll pick up from there. I'll be right back. Quack, quack. What are you guys doing? Are you guys for real? Quack, quack, quack. You guys have a lot to talk about? Yeah, me too. Whoa! Alright, I'll, I'll catch you guys later.
Quack, quack. What are you guys doing? Are you guys for real? Quack, quack, quack. You guys have a lot to talk about? Yeah, me too. Whoa! Alright, I'll, I'll catch you guys later. All right. We're back. Oh, I should leave the ink ribbons back there. Hang on. Let me do that.
we don't know what happened to Billy. Got attacked by one of the monkeys. Giant humanoid is being suspended in bioorganic fluid inside a capsule. Huh. He looks familiar. I've seen him. Oh, fuck. God damn it. No. I don't have any healing things. Gosh. you Pink ribbon and grenades Let's save.
Okay, we're nearly done with this area. We'll do that. Oh boy.
too quiet, too chill. Are you okay, Rebecca? Where is everybody? They should have arrived here before me. Haven't you seen them? That's unfortunate. If we go straight from here, we should arrive at an old mansion which Umbrella uses for research. Come on, let's go. Wait, I've got to find Billy. Billy Cohen? You mean you found that criminal? Yes, but we got separated and... No point worrying about him. He won't make it. Come on, let's go. Sir, please. I need to find him. Don't worry. I'll catch up with you. I Rebecca, need to find him. All right. Just be careful. I never saw him again. Oh, no. Aww. A key. Where did he go? Oh boy. Elevator. Fuck. What is that? I hate it. Shit.
No? Stay down. Oh no! Oh no, all my... All my ink! Is on the other side of this fucking door! Oh, that's bad. Oh, that's very bad. It's like, how many were there? Like, 18 or something? I don't know, something crazy. I had like a crazy amount. Oh, wow. That's... That's bad. That's really bad. Oh, that's bad. What's our health like? Caution. It's not good either. It was just a, a long ride. Let's, let's do some. Let's experiment here. Because if level two... I don't know if I can take the turntable again. I'm confused. Where the hell are we right now? It's just a regular zombie. Whew. It is not. Cannot carry this item, you motherfuckers. Oh boy. This is gonna hurt, isn't it? Down. 
Let me see. Take that turntable. I don't think you can. I think you can do it. Damn it. There's no better way to say it. Fuck. <laughs> we just lost all the ink. Let me pause it. Da, da, da. Ba, ba, ba. <laughs> Playtime is over. You and your friends no longer amuse me. Good riddance. Now nothing will stop me from getting my revenge. Oh, that's not good.
some area power supply panel. down somewhere where I can actually reach them. Supply power. See what I can do about this puzzle. I'm trying to see what they mean here. Two, three, four, five, six. That's kind of. Okay, okay. Um Right.
No, that, that's the wrong. Wrong. Can I go back? That's wrong too. I think this is right. Stored. tank talking about oh if I go up okay
Let me do that real quick. I'm gonna get some Molotov cocktails. Star, how's it going? What's up? We're getting we're getting close to the end here. Resident Evil Zero. Trying to save Billy. Being attacked by a sea monster and washed down a river into a sewer or something. But no rush, no rush. It's not. I need urgency here. No rush. We'll get there when we get there. What's new with you? Okay, we killed those boys. Okay. Three zombies. Okay, there's a lot of things going on right now in the game. Okay. It's gonna get crazy, I guess. Let's hope there's not any... Ooh, fuck that, dude. doesn't have a handle. What's wrong with people? Why do they keep stealing handles to doors in these games? What's the problem? Ooh, right in the head, that last shot. Get up. I dare you. I dare you. Oh man, I'm gonna go back and get the gasoline. I can get the gasoline. The map here.
They really could use more item boxes. In this game, you just need the ability to be able to store and transfer ob objects, because that's the only thing that's slowing me down, is just the fact that every time I need something, I gotta, like, backtrack, pick up something I left in another room. Those. Okay. I'm gonna go back and get the uh, the ink. It just ruins the pace of this game, which actually. This game was a little longer, but I guess it's not quite as long as I thought. Because there's six areas, but there's like two of them that are pretty brief. So it kind of makes it seem like it's a long game, because it's got a lot of different areas, but... Ink was back here, and I'm not gonna save yet. Gotta down here. Uh, let's see. We'll have a puzzle. Like I said, we'll probably uh, split the stream and uh, we'll come back later tonight and wrap up Resident Evil Zero and then we can look at um, what we want to do with Resident Evil 1. Uh, I don't know if we'll start that over the weekend or not. We will, we will have to see about it. Okay. Uh, let's see here. Nice. Okay. Figure out where I want to go. So there, here, and there. That wheel to open the door. Ha, uh, Sam, what's up, dude? Went down the stairs. Okay. Wait, there's something up there. Okay. Yeah, we gotta move the boxes. Strategically, okay. Oh, 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 hang on. Let's grab this. 
have any jump scares. Well, I got I got the gunshot at 100 bits, but I think that's all. That's all I have on jam. I'm gonna go back up and get those those magnum rounds real quick, just to bring them down here to this area. But yeah, I think I think we'll continue this later. Probably come back after I have some dinner. And uh, we'll wrap up this game. And I, I don't know what we're going to do over the weekend. I might play some more Resident Evil or we might uh, break it up. Uh, before we start Resident Evil 1, we might play something else real quick. We can wrap up a, a different game. Just so I don't get burned out on Resident Evil stuff. Because Resident Evil 1 is very similar to this game. I think it might be... A, I think I might like it a little. Just because I think it's a little easier. Or maybe it's I'm more familiar with the, with the story and... All the puzzles and stuff, you know, it makes more, more sense. So let's drop that one on the map. There's a ladder down there. And puzzles. Reservoir room. Well, maybe Billy, uh... <laughs> well, I don't know what the word is. Got flushed. Down here. Billy! Look how they massacred my boy. Rebecca, where am I? You're safe now. Are you okay? Could have done this. They must have been used as test subjects in Marcus's research. Yikes. He must have kept messing around with the mother virus. Billy? Hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Billy. Oh, Billy's got the grenades. Okay. And the shotgun. Yeah, he's he's locked and loaded. single leech alive. Big 
guns right now. Oh, can I, uh... Check over there. Yeah. Let's go. Okay. Okay, so I, th I think we have to solve the puzzle. Hello? the healing thing on me just in case. That's where the valve is. Oh, I need to leave. I'll check it out. Roger. Leave her up there on the control panel. Okay, so I think I'm gonna save this puzzle. We'll, we'll knock this one out um, after dinner. And I'll leave the game uh, paused. Let me uh, bring us over here. That on charge. My haunted house back there. Um, Okay, so we will uh, come back later tonight after a little dinner break. Um, maybe 8 or 9 p.m. Central, and we'll continue Resident Evil Zero. I think we'll be able to finish it tonight. It's it's not, there's not much left, really. A um, couple of puzzles, probably some boss fights trying to escape. Uh, my good buddy, Ageless Nation, over here, is playing uh, some Star Wars Squadrons. So we can check that out. I don't know if my Twitch chat's being weird or what. Strange. Gosh, what a mess. Twitch is just. All right, guys. Uh, thank you for watching. Hope you guys have a great night. Like I said, we'll be back and finish up some Resident Evil Zero later tonight. Take care.